This week, the head of the United Nations warned the war in Ukraine has a good chance of spilling over into other countries. Poland has been preparing for that possibility for months. Poland sits to the west of Ukraine and is one of its staunchest supporters. The Polish government led the charge to give Ukraine main battle tanks from the west, like the Leopard 2s. Poland is also hosting Ukrainian tank crews to learn how to operate Leopards. The Polish Prime Minister was one of the first world leaders to say NATO allies should give Ukraine F-16 fighter jets. And this week, the Polish president is meeting with Ukrainian leader Volodymyr Zelensky to talk about further military cooperation between the two countries. A Russian defeat in Ukraine is vital to Poland because the alternative means Poland is likely the next target of Russian aggression. Ramzan Kadyrov, a key Putin ally and the leader of Chechnya, said this week he's not going to hide his intentions anymore, and he wants to invade Poland immediately after Ukraine falls. Tens of thousands of Russian troops and armored divisions are preparing for an impending Ukraine offensive. They're staging in Belarus, which also shares a border with Poland. The war in Ukraine is creating a humanitarian crisis in Eastern Europe, which Poland says is by Russian design to destabilize European economies. Poland said time and again, its commitment to Ukraine is unwavering, but that doesn't mean Poland is not preparing at home. In an effort to ward off an influx of refugees from Belarus, Poland closed another key checkpoint along the border this week, a move Belarus condemned as, quote, catastrophic. Poland is ramping up its defense spending budget to 4% of GDP and just agreed to buy $10 billion worth of HIMARS and long-range attack missiles from the U.S. In addition to fortifying its professional military, Poland is also working with civilians in a program called Train with the Army. Every Polish citizen aged 16 to 65 is invited to learn from military instructors who teach weapons handling, survival fundamentals, and first aid. President Joe Biden is also said to be planning a trip to Poland soon, further solidifying the former Soviet bloc country's status as a key ally in the fight against Russia. We have plenty of stories about the war in Ukraine. You can find the unbiased straight facts at straightarrownews.com.